This is going to be a fun video. You guys sent in the best fucking photos. I cannot wait to share all of your submissions today. In today's video, I really wanted to do like a compilation type video with your actual photos that you guys submitted for group costume ideas. That's what this is all about. Um, I have seen so many incredible group costumes, like over costumes, or I guess you could say themes, or like whatever you want to call it. Um, over the years, in the tons of festivals that I've attended, you guys are so creative. It's one of the most entertaining things I think about going to raves or going to shows is when people get like super into it and like put in the effort to like show up in a themed outfit or group costume whatever it is so i've seen some incredible stuff i asked you guys on instagram and on twitter and on youtube to send me like your best rave costumes and i got some awesome ones in here so i'm going to be sharing your ideas with everybody just to help out other people who may be like trying to plan for upcoming festivals and like work something out with their rave fam so you're going to have tons of suggestions in this video i'm also going to give you guys some of my own personal suggestions on like how you can even go about coming up with a rave fam outfit. Yeah, I think that's how all I have for the intro. I just want to get into this video. I'm trying to make this a shorter one. I don't think it'll be too, too long. <laughs> but um, I'm just going to start off by saying a couple ideas for you guys. Oh, and before I forget, please subscribe if you aren't subscribed already and share this video with your rave fam when we're done. I'm going to try and shout out as many of you as I possibly can. So thank you guys for your submissions. So please comment below your ideas. Or if you guys didn't get a chance to submit it or make it to this video, let me know what your family has dressed up as so we can just like get some more ideas going here. So anyway, I'll start off by saying there's a couple ways you can go about this, right? So one is like a full-blown costume where you guys are like a legitimate theme or your characters, whatever it is, and you guys are like fully dressed up. So I've seen like superheroes before i'll pop up in pictures here like as i go yeah i've seen superheroes i've seen cows i've seen people in different onesies like basically where it's like really a costume and you're dressing up as like certain characters or a theme so i think that's one way of going about it another way that's like more subtle that i've seen that i think is really creative is people will just pick like a theme and incorporate it into their outfits so when i was at ever after i saw a lot of this it was more than i thought i didn't think people would get that dressed up but it was actually really cool. So I've seen like um, like a checkered pattern. So people will just all incorporate checkered some a checkered pattern somewhere in their outfit, neon, camo, like whatever it is. Um, you'll sort of just pick one type of like pattern or color or something like that, and everyone will just incorporate it. So that is a more like subtle way to go about it. But either way, it's just a fun way to like identify that your group is together. I think it's awesome. I love that you guys get so creative with it, and it's cool just to like have an identifier for like your whole rave family. So. Let's just get into what you guys submitted. So I'm gonna read some ideas and then I'm gonna pop up some pictures. So, oh, so this is a good example. So somebody say they, they all wore tie-dye shirts. That's a super easy one to do. Like you can tie-dye anything yourself or you can buy some stuff. Somebody else making tie-dye with the fam gives you time before the festival to hang out and then you all look, then you all look fly. That was from Dream on the Beat. That's a good one. Pokemon theme. Legends of the Hidden Temple. I've seen a couple of those. That's a good one for all like my 90s babies. It's Becky said, currently planning one for next EDC. We'll keep you updated. Uh, Jesse R0824 said, me and my rave fam were Pac-Man ghosts for beyond and our totem was Pac-Man. That's awesome. Incorporating the totem into it too is an awesome idea. Teletubbies, I have a picture of that. It's from J Train, J Train 514. Space theme at one festival, army theme for another. That was a really popular one. I got a couple people who submitted um, that they were like galaxy or space themes. That's an easy one to incorporate into an outfit. What else we got? Electric Pokemon Perlers, outfits for EDC Kinetic Energy theme. That's a good one. Matching homemade um, Black Tiger sex machine and Zomboy shirts. That is also a really good way to go. If you guys all like have a favorite artist in common, why not just wear their merch or make your own merch and then all just like show up and represent for your favorite artist. That's a good one. Uh, Rissa What said, my fam normally does themes for two plus day events. We do black and white and rainbow. That's an awesome one. Um, Sev87 said, Super Mario World. I was Luigi. My friends are Mario, Princess Peach, and Daisy. Love it. Drew95 said space theme and then neon yellow and pink. Carlita said mermaids for EDC 2018. Oh, I love that. It was probably such a good one. You can get like wigs too. Like get as into it as you want. A lot of these festivals are like 
it's very common for people to dress up, especially coming up like I'm going to Electric Zoo and then I'm going to Imagine Music Festival. I feel like those are both really big ones for people getting into it. Um, Ivana said, every year me and my boyfriend go as rave Michael Myers and Ghostface. I have a picture of this, so stay tuned. I'll pop it up in here. Um, this is awesome. Getting getting witty with it said Revengers, like rave Avengers. Love that. Emily Perez, 7374, said, At Escape May 17, my rave squad of about 10 went as Sailors and Mermaids. That's a dope one. Batman, Poison Ivy, and Two Face. Oh, that's a good one. M. Kamala, 7, said, Space theme, Dead Moon, Neon Green, but they forgot to tell me. <laughs> that sucks. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, so I'll pop some photos in here. Like I said, the Teletubbies one was good because it's just like a sort of one and done. Like, that's an easier thing, too. If you do a, a onesie as well, if it's like a colder festival or it's winter or something, you can just easily like pop on a onesie and be done with it. Let's see the other pictures. Oh, I loved this. Operation Ultra Gay. Fucking fabulous. They all dressed up in an army theme. I love that. Oh, this was submitted on Twitter. I love this. They dressed up as elements from the periodic table, so they were gold and silver, and they had like the little periodic table sign on them. I think that is so cool. That's really clever too. Cool. Oh, I loved this one. I remember this one. They were all rainbow. So they were all like colors of the rainbow, and then the one person was dressed up in like a full rainbow outfit. This one was so fucking cool. I'm gonna like pop it up on the screen, but I'll show you. They all designed jerseys for their Ray family, and their friend like created a Ray family logo for them. So dope. I'll show you here. So their friend like created that logo, and they all got matching jerseys. I fucking love that. That is so creative. Average Joes, that's such a good one, especially like if you can dress up like a, as one of your favorite movies or your TV shows, like Game of Thrones, I'm sure people have done. America themed is a good one. All of the USA stuff and American flags. The cows, like I said, so you could 1000%. I feel like animal print is an easy one to incorporate at this point, like doing leopard print, snake skin, like a lot of clothing companies are like doing the animal print trend right now. So that's a big one. But anyway, so all of those are all the submissions that I got. Um, Thank you guys so much for sending in your ideas. This definitely like made me want to go do like a themed thing with my friends. I feel like Spice Girls would be good. I don't know. There's so many different ways you could go about it. But like I said, if you don't want to go like full blown costume, definitely pick like a pattern or a color and try and incorporate that into your outfit and just like get the whole family involved. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you like these like group costume idea videos. Uh, I had so much fun going through your submissions. It was awesome. You guys are so creative. I love it so much. The Ray family logo absolutely nailed it comment down below again what you guys have done what are you planning to do which one of these is your favorite did you have a favorite that i showed you guys today again you can follow me on twitter and on instagram at emma capotis i'm regularly asking you guys like doing polls and asking you guys questions and taking submissions for these videos so definitely go follow me there if you haven't already so you don't miss out on the opportunity to be in a video thank you all again for submitting everything i hope you enjoyed this video i'll see you in my next one bye guys